Hey, what's up guys? This is Howie and I start off the day getting ready to go to the Pearson NCLEX RN testing center. Now I've done Pearson before with other correspondence classes when I was in the military and I've also done the Pearson exams when I was in LVN. So this wasn't too much of a surprise but I just wanted to make sure that I knew exactly where I was going and that I was on time because you don't want to be late. There's too much at stake. So I just finished taking the NCLEX RN exam for the second time. Some thoughts, um, there was a lot of SATA questions, I thought that was good, but you know, I can never depend on that. I had a decent amount of SATA questions last time too, um, but there was a lot more for this one. Um, the test ended exactly at 75 questions rather than 78, so I don't know what that means. It's either really good or really bad. Um, I'm glad I left my phone so I don't have to worry about that. Um, I was very anxious throughout the test. Usually I'm pretty um, confident and a little bit arrogant actually but um, because this is my second time I was definitely anxious. I had to stop a couple of times. I had to take one unscheduled break. I, I didn't take the scheduled break. I brought snacks but I didn't eat anything. Um, for about every 10 or 15 questions though if I didn't get enough SATA questions or if I got a SATA question, because those never make you feel good, um, I would have to look down and I would uh, just give myself like a pep talk, like say, hey, you're doing great, uh, you're gonna do this, um, and uh, you're gonna keep going, and then just work systematically. So the different things I did this test, this time around, was that I did work systematically, which was actually one of the tips uh, written on the test. Um, I did keep in mind with the time, I knew that um, I was expecting to go all the way to 265 questions. In fact, that would have made me feel better. Um, but uh, I, I made the first 75 questions really quality, really thought about it, um, and really narrowed down my choices until I made the uh, choice that was I was the most comfortable with. It was never really that comfortable at all anyway. And what else? Um, yeah, uh, I had a little bit of, a, I had a strategy this time, but I definitely had to uh, keep giving myself a pep talk, keep telling myself that I'm, I studied and I did well and that um, I'm objective with the questions and, you know, just kind of kept in mind, be, be, been more aware. And I was also prepared to go all the way to 265 questions. I knew that I would probably speed it up. Uh, with answering questions once I went over 75 but uh, I didn't go over 75 questions I stopped at 75 so who knows I don't want to check the Pearson uh, the Pearson um, the check test yet um, I'm gonna wait a couple hours I don't want to stress myself out and um, maybe just wait like 24 hours try again in 24 hours but I'm really worried so I'm gonna try to go online to the NCSBN website Pearson website and try to re-register. If I'm able to re-register and it takes my card, then uh, that's the worst feeling. But if it doesn't take my register, my re-registration and doesn't take my card, then I'll take that as a good sign. So wish me luck.